we'll catch up now with Andre Lavax. Andre is, of course, president of uh, Western Cape Chess. Um, Andre, uh, how are things on your side? Uh, JP, that can be a good so, uh, um, uh, I'm just happy to be back and uh, happy also to speak to the viewers and uh, to take sports further in the Western Cape. I think we are at a very, very good, uh, uh, on a, if I can speak uh, in chess terms, we are in a very good position and uh, we're very uh, extremely um, excited and uh, also thank you for all the initiative that you're taking. I think uh, the Western Cape uh, Chess Confederation is doing extremely well in, uh, well in keeping everyone together and making sure that uh, we serve the, the sporting community. So the last time we spoke, which was about three weeks ago, four weeks ago or so, we, you, you guys had started this uh, incredible initiative of playing online um, uh, and that was your big launch. Give us a little bit of feedback. Uh, how, how did things go there? Um, are you up and running? Are people jumping on and playing online chess? Has, has your membership grown by millions? <laughs> uh, oh, uh, thank you very I, I see that word is very prophetic. We're working towards the millions uh, because we want each and every person, every, every citizen in the Western Cape to play chess and to learn chess. Uh, um, after all, so thank you very much for that prophetic word. But uh, yes, we are doing extremely well. Our region uh, regions are booming. The tournaments are being run on a weekly basis. We have uh, inter-regional competitions in the Western Cape. We have national competitions. So everything is just working well. But uh, this initiative that I'm coming to talk to you about is, I think, a little bit more. We want to. We do want. We don't want to do more. We want to do better. Yeah. And I, I'm just happy there to talk about these initiatives. Maybe just tell us one, one, why we got to this point. Because the last we spoke, you had a high performance coaching scenario. And now you've got this initiative, which sort of connects to that. Yes. So what we would like to uh, look at is that how do we uh, uh, link the high performance coaching to all regions. So what we've started with is uh, we link. Uh, the activity to all the head coaches in the regions to make sure that quality coaching is everywhere. Um, we uh, and as I spoke uh, about last uh, last time is that we are moving into internet chess big time. Yeah, uh, yeah. we are working together with Chess South Africa. We've been writing uh, um, online chess regulations to make sure that there's fair play but to make sure that all players have access to quality rated games. So we are exploring uh, at this stage to see whether uh, uh, players can play online rated yep. games. Right, and if right. I mean rated games, it means that your rating uh, and your rankings in South Africa can be changed through internet play. So, but, okay. but, but we are um, exploring different ways. So, but one thing that we've also realized is that not everyone can play rated games or online games for that matter because uh, if you look at uh, a lot of the poor people in our province or in our country they do not have, have access to ict and that is one of the uh, most worrying factors we want to develop chess or develop talent everywhere and i think uh, we are now at a very good uh, uh, stage or position where we can say let us extend this to poor communities and that's why we are uh, organizing this massive tournament on the 18th of uh, um, july right. it's called the mandela Day tournament where we are saying let us join effort even if you're not a chess uh, a player or even if you're not a chess fanatic let us work together to make sure the children in our country or the children in our province get better services, that get access to, 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 to um, online chess, and not only on ch online chess. So what we're trying to do is raise funds, okay. and that fund will be uh, used to make sure that children that cannot afford coaching a, a good quality, uh, high-ranking coach, that we use that uh, money, we pay the lessons of those children, and make sure that we really develop the potential of children in uh, the most, 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 uh, um, say, uh, remote towns. So let's just talk about that now. Really what we're talking about now is a fundraising initiative that's going to drive your, your, your support for your coaches and at the same time drive support for the children out there who need devices. Um, and, 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 and so I'm assuming that there are maybe multiple ways to support this initiative. 
Um, one is, of course, financial. Yeah. That's the obvious one. If we've got a big multi-million rand sponsor out yeah. there, they can sponsor you. But what are the other ways that people yeah. can uh, uh, contribute? How else do people um, sponsor and get involved? Yeah, there's, there's a few options. Even if you're not really a competitive player that want to achieve the top spot in the province or national, we want to encourage you to play because it's for a good cause. Yes. Uh, if you lose, it means the children that are poor, that cannot afford to play, they win. So we want to make sure the children win. Uh, we want to uh, uh, also uh, push away the competition a little bit to make sure that if you uh, 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 participate in the tournament, you pay your tournament fee, the, chil the, the money will go directly to the children. That's, that's the, the first so option. The other option is if you cannot play or even if you um, busy doing something else, you can donate money. Okay. So you will see on the screen we have our bank account and bank account details there. All you know, you can even do make a donation of 20 rand. Uh, the reference that you use, you uh, um, can use your name and you just put Mandela Day and, um, and, and, and that is it. And that makes you, and I think it's a safe way also. Yes. The, uh, uh, the previous years we went out to, uh, to have soup kitchens, to build, uh, to paint buildings. This time around, it's not safe for you to do that. So come and uh, um, maybe support chess by just doing a donation. I want to actually also encourage all the other sporting codes to say, let's jump in, let us support chess so that we can help poor and vulnerable children. The other thing is that uh, what you can also do, if you have an old smart device uh, lying around at your home, the children can find it useful. You can contact me, uh, JP, you can uh, uh, also put my email address, my, my cell phone num number, and we can arrange, we have uh, clubs all around the province, we yeah. have regions all around the province, they can come and collect the devices. Um, Andre, so let me just summarize this for you. For people to help you with this fundraising initiative, you've essentially got a big tournament that's happening on Mandela Day, and uh, participants can enter into that competition, and those f uh, registration fees will be part of the funds that you're raising to contribute to your initiative. And then, of course, the other way is to contribute financially um, on the, to the bank account that we're seeing on the screen here, uh, using yes. that reference number with your name and uh, Mandela Day. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. And I think uh, um, that is a, such an empowering initiative is that it's uh, the, the devices can be used not only to play chess, but we also know there's uh, hundreds and thousands of children that doesn't have access to computers or um, to yeah, internet yeah. to do their schoolwork. So uh, I, I, we want to of encourage course, yeah. that as well. So to empower people at all fronts. Andre, we're going to leave it at that. We're going to say to you, regardless of all of this stuff, obviously you must remember to stay safe, stay isolated, and uh, we hope that all your athletes out there and administrators are doing well and are, of course, uh, um, safe and, as we say, isolated. Thank you, uh, JP, and thank, thank you to the uh, um, viewers, and I thank everyone in advance for participating. There we go, folks. Andre Levax, President of Western Cape Chess, fantastic initiative get your money in sign up contribute uh, and find those old devices donate to chess